What's up guys, it's the Boo here, welcome back to another Minecraft Let's Play. Today we're gonna do something a bit different from last time, uh, with my commentary basically. So, these videos are pre-recorded, which is why it's in the version 1.15, and my voice is overlaid on them, so was it on the last episode. And so, ne from next episode onwards, it's definitely gonna be 1.16, and I'm gonna be talking during the game, and that's the voice that you're gonna hear. So do get subscribed if you want to be notified when things are the way it's supposed to be. I hope you guys were enjoying the tour I'm doing of my base. You see, I didn't do a lot off camera, just increase the wheat production and oh, also I create, I made a campfire which I probably should have done in the beginning. And I'm gonna go over here, there is the sugarcane and yeah, that's all I've been doing off camera. I got some coal of course and I planted a few trees and well, that's about it. In this episode, we are going mining, but first of all, I'm gonna go check that chest I found in the arctic biome, remember in episode 1? Yeah, so I'm gonna take my boat and go over there, see see what's in there. Well, on the way there, I found a cavern that I sort of missed last night, so I'm just gonna go check that out. And as you can see, mistakes were made. I have no idea what I was trying to accomplish, and and what what what's that? What what happened to my boat right there? Like, come on. Okay, I don't want to mess around here any longer. I'll come back later. Just gonna take my boat, get out of here, go back to what I was doing, you know. Well, that's not what I was expecting, but uh, I guess that's okay. I, I got coal and wheat and uh, leather armor. So, cool. Now I'll just uh, take all of that and get out of here real quickly because I don't want to deal with any more drowned. Well, that was worth it, wasn't it guys? It was so worth it. Let's just hope there's something good in this cavern over here too. Just gonna park my boat over here. Don't want to make another mistake again. And let's have us set the stuff around and time to carefully jump in. Nope, that hurt. Well, I'm just gonna toss up this area. And skeleton with an enchanted bow. Don't wanna mess with that. I'll just continue lighting this up and focus on mining on this section first, I guess. Then we'll see what we can do about the skeleton. Alright, so while I mine this part out, I'd like to talk about the channel a bit. By the time this episode is out, I'd have started streaming over on Twitch, so if you would like to head over there and check it out, it would be much appreciated. Currently I'm streaming with my friends on Mondays at 9.30pm, GTMT plus 5.30, but I will be definitely starting a few slower streams as well for random Minecraft stuff, so if you're into that, please feel free to follow my channel over there and join me while I play. Okay then, now that that's out of the way, guess I have to go deal with that skeleton. Well, uh, I kind of have an idea, but I don't think it's a good idea. But then again, I haven't had a good idea so far in this series, so why not go ahead with it? So the idea was to just keep running, lighten this up to the other end, and let all the monsters that were up there fall down and see what I can do with it. But it was just a skeleton, so things, things turned out pretty well for me. A little bit of me fighting for my life and there we go, the first monster killed in this world. And no drops. Well, now that he's gone, I guess I'll just finish out mining this place and head back to the base, I guess. Oh, and while that's happening, I'd like to let you guys know that I have set up a Patreon account. So if anyone's interested in supporting the channel further, subscriptions would be greatly appreciated. Also, want to put it out there that nobody will be missing out on anything much for not being a patron. The benefits will just be stuff like having your name at the end of the video and helping out with making decisions, like what to call my community. So basically, it's only for fans who want to interact with me more. That was barely a cave, so I'm not stopping the episode there. I'm just gonna keep these things over here and go look for another one. Now around here I heard one of those sounds that come when there's a cave nearby, you know those really loud minecraft sounds, 
but my game audio was too low and it didn't make it into a recording so just letting you know and after a bit of looking around i found the entrance it was a small hole but i think it went pretty deep ah don't don't take that out of context please time to go in check what's inside and hopefully i won't die let's start mining I was just lighting the things up and uh, actually got scared for a bat. And when I finally did decide to get brave and go check the place out, it was actually more than just bats in there, so I was being safe, I guess. So after getting rid of the zombie and running away from the skeleton, this guy decides to pop out of nowhere. I mean, I did not see him at all when I was running away. And where did he come from? Well, at least he gave me some good armor. I mean, it's gold, but it's better than what I had. And now that it's safe, I guess I'll get to mining, get all this iron and coal. I'll just have some nice homemade bread and then go check out the cave, away from the skeleton. Well, that looks like it goes a lot deeper. I think I'll just go get rid of this gravel over here with a little trick that makes it kinda easy to get rid of these and that'll make it safer for later. Just place a bunch of torches down below the gravel and then after it's done just find find some place to place something and make it all fall down on them. Now I'll just place my crafting table here and probably make this area my base for mining in this cave at least. And when I go up here, I notice one that the skeleton is gone and also that I forgot to bring a bucket, which is important when mining, especially for lava lakes. So after heading back and getting some iron equipment and throwing an egg into the water, which was unintentional, finally get some water and I can get rid of that lava lake over there. So nice how that happens. Time to go in that hole, see what's in there. Hopefully, some good stuff to mine. It had a lot more coal in there. And also, I did hear a few sounds of mobs around, so I continued digging and found a small cave. And now you can see me carefully try to find my way down there without getting hurt. And when I finally get the courage to go down, I get greeted by a skeleton. I really hate skeletons. It took a while to fight also, I was freaking out and getting so scared that I was gonna die. But I eventually got rid of it. I just wanna let you all know, this is not me fast forwarding, it's just how fast I am when I'm running away from potential danger. Now, getting back in the cave, gonna just light things up. I don't like the looks of that. Uh, other way also, nothing much. I'm just gonna do a quick fast forward while I mine things out and do a little exploration. Nothing interesting, of course. And I dug through the wall again and found a huge cavern and this is probably where I'm gonna go now if I can find a way to get rid of these mobs. Well that was easy. Now to make a very safe bridge across. Very slow and very safe. Okay finally made it here. Now just to go explore a bit, torch the place up, check where this, this tunnel goes to. And once again, another mining fast forward. While that's happening, I'd like to let you all know that I do have an Instagram and a Facebook page up and running where I will be posting updates on new videos and random livestreams. 
so feel free to check those out if you want to know about them. And I have spotted another of these horrifying creatures, but I was a fool to think that I could sneak up on them. Enjoy my panic-filled attempt to get out of this situation. Mistakes were made. Now I have to go get my water back. Just blocking this area off to be safe. I was feeling a bit brave. But not brave enough. Little did I know, my running away from danger would be my undoing. And now it's just me trying again and again, trying to get my stuff back. So many monsters now, it made me freak out even more. And I was not even expecting that we need the man here. <sighs> Gotta keep going. This time my plan is just to keep running away. Well, that worked. I actually got my stuff back. Well, most of it, but... Now all that's left to do is find a way out of here. Cool. No, must stay focused. Well, I got another idea that might not work, but hey, two of them in the same video. <laughs> that's a record. Just me being careful again. And making mistakes. I'm definitely coming back here to check this out. Time to go! That actually went better than I expected. Should be safe from now on. Maybe not that way. And finally, after so many attempts, we got the stuff back home. Now to just make sure everything's safe. And that's all I got for this episode. Wasn't that exhausting? I hope you all enjoyed it, and if you did, feel free to hit that like button and let me know what your favorite part was in the comments below. Also, get subscribed if you want to see more videos like this. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.